Joining me now is Armin Bravo, who is an actor from Semi Kaplanolis film Grain. Thank you so much for joining us on Showcase. So tell me about how you first um, got the role in acting in this film. Uh, so it was through an audition that I did for uh, Semi in uh, Istanbul, first by video and then we we've met in uh, Istanbul. And it was a very interesting experience. We went through uh, some scenes, some monologues, we talked a lot. Uh, and then they invited me to, to, to be in the film. And Grain was a very complex film, given even that it was shot in three different countries. Um, and from my understanding, you guys went through a lot of hardships while filming. Tell us about um, all the hardships that you guys went through. Uh, it's a complicated film uh, and it was not uh, easy to, to shoot as well. Uh, so very harsh uh, conditions and uh, different locations. Uh, and also emotionally, physically, psychologically, mentally, it's very complex. The role is very complex. It's very deep and spiritual. Mm. Uh, so you need a lot of concentration, a lot of verticality, I'd say. Um, Physically, also a lot of well injuries for me. I, I injured my finger during the shooting, and uh, uh, we had to do a small operation on oh, it. Wow. Uh, so it was uh, physically challenging, mentally. But I think um, when I when I saw the film, I feel it was worth it. Yeah. And what was what does the film mean to you, on a personal level, on an emotional level, on a physical level? Well, apart from, from the process that was really uh, interesting and something, the way of working with a director that I've never done. Uh, what I like uh, in the film uh, and what is meaningful to me is that it's um, layered. So you can follow the film on different layers, on scientific uh, one that is basically, you can watch it as SF film mm. maybe. Uh, but then on spiritual and even religious level, you can follow the story. Uh, so, so I like that mixture of science and religion in one film. It's also, it's very beautifully shot film. It has this quality, like a classic film uh, quality, black and white. Uh, and it's also, it was very important for me to, to also go through a journey, through a spiritual journey with this film, uh, me as my character as well. So without giving too much away to audiences who haven't watched the film yet, uh, tell us more about the character you played itself. <laughs> it's very difficult to explain it if we don't want to uh, <laughs> give out a lot, um, but he's a G uh, genetic scientist mm -hmm. uh, who used to work in a corporation in a big company and then um, they sue him expel him uh, from the company and then he went through his own journey to um, out of the company and into into wilderness to find genetically unmodified seed um, and then there's this other scientist who uh, is going through similar journey mm -hmm. uh, to find him uh, and to get some kind of knowledge that is otherworldly that is not uh, yeah that is a spiritual knowledge so do you have any other upcoming projects that we should be looking out for any films documentaries uh, yes, I just uh, directed my own film, short film called uh, Breath, so I'm in post-production now and it's, it's the first time directing for me, so it's a wonderful experience and something that I'm looking forward to. I also write another script for a feature film and preparing for uh, another film that I'm doing uh, in Croatia, wonderful story about a Croatian woman who's, uh, who helped uh, uh, save uh, 1,000 children from concentration wow. camps uh, during the Second World War. Wow, so that's very exciting. We'll be sure to look out for your upcoming projects as well. Thank you so much for joining us on Showcase today. Thank you for inviting me.